Good day viewers, you are welcome. Let's see how we can solve this nice system of equations for C and D. We have two system of equations here. We have CD equals 48 and C plus D equals 2. So we call this one equation 1 and we call this one equation 2. Here we have the solution. Let's say we consider from equation 2. Equation 2 says C plus D equals 2. Then let's make this uh, the subject by transferring C to other side as we have 2 minus C. This is our new equations. We call this equation 3. Then let's substitute this equation 3 into equation 1. The equation 1 says CD equals 48. And by replacing D here with 2 minus C, we have C multiplied by 2 minus C equals 48. By opening this parenthesis with C, C times 2, that is 2C, minus C times C, that is C squared, equals 48. Then let's multiply 2 by negative. By multiplying this one by negative, we have minus 2c. This multiply by negative, we have plus c squared equals this by negative, we have minus 48. Then by changing this, we have c squared minus 2c equals minus 48. Here we have a quadratic equation as let's say we add 1 to both sides. We have c squared minus 2c plus 1 equals minus 48 plus 1. Then this one is in the form of, suppose we have this as c squared minus 2 times 1 times c, then plus 1 squared. This equals minus 47 and the whole of this is let's say we consider it with a squared minus 2ab plus c let's say we have a squared minus 2ab plus b squared and this gives a minus b all squared then by replacing it we have c minus 1 squared equals minus 47. Let's take the square root of both sides. By taking the square root of both sides, we have this as c minus 1 equals plus or minus. We have square root of minus 47. Then we have... So let's take 1 to other side. We have c equals 1 plus or minus. The square root of so here we call this one minus 1 times 47 then c equals 1 plus or minus so we separate this as square root of minus 1 multiplied by square root of 47 <coughs> after having the square root of minus 1 here so this is given as i so it's an imaginary root so we just call it i iota multiply by square root of 47 this is an irrational root so we leave it as c equals 1 plus or minus i square root of 47 and when we recall to get d we have to recall from d equals 2 minus c by replacing this one with c we have d equals 2 minus open bracket 1 plus or minus i square root of 47 and here we have the expansion of this that is 2 minus 1 plus or minus and when we now open this one with parentheses minus times plus that is minus minus times minus we have plus square root of 47 so here we have d equals 2 minus 1, that is 1, then minus plus i root 47. So this is the value of 
d that we got here as we already have the value of c above which is equals 1 plus or minus i root 47. So this is how to solve this problem. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to this channel. See you in the next class. Never stop learning. Bye bye.